If you're okay with a short drive, then look no further to Fashion Farm in Ligonier, a must-add stop for any fall fun adventure. Fashion Farm Pumpkin Fantasy Land consists of pumpkin, gourd, and squash displays featuring U.S. presidents and other well-known characters. The current owner, Patty Pumpkin, had the business passed down to her from her father, Charlie Pumpkin. We've been doing this for almost 50 years. Um, people know us. It's a tradition. Many customers come every year to enjoy the pumpkin creations. The McCauley family from Middlebury makes the trek annually. And how many times have you guys been here? Is this like a oh, box so every of year? Oh. Every year, yeah. yeah. I was going to say, year. I have pictures of them like in their baby carriers. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> yeah. Pumpkin Fantasy Land keeps guests intrigued and coming back for more by changing every year. Our theme this year is mythical, magical characters. We have a different theme each year. Families enjoy going through the Pumpkin Fantasy Land and seeing the new creations that the staff comes up with. Well, I think first, I think like the thing that people like most traditional about it is going in and seeing all the painted and carved yeah. pumpkins. Seeing almost 20,000 families and school groups in their single month of being open, Pumpkin Fantasyland has activities for all age groups. I think the most fun is to watch the children and watch the adults laugh and have fun as a family. If you get hungry on your trip to Pumpkin Fantasyland, the staff has you covered. Uh, we do have um, refreshments. Uh, pumpkin donuts is a staple. Donuts and the ice, ice cream, cream. Yep. and all the good stuff too. Pumpkin Fantasyland added a new attraction to their fall fun this year. We do have a new uh, activity here this year. We have a new slide. It's 16 foot tall, 100 feet long. Open until October 31st, Fashion Farm is still encouraging people to come on out for Hay Rides, their Fantasy Pumpkin Land, and their 16 foot slide. Reporting for Globe News, I'm Amelia Turnbull.